Okay, so I don't really like DIY at all, but I will say that sometimes I see some DIYs that really catch my eye that I really just want to share with you all because they're actually really good. First, Emma, Caitlin, and Jolie really introduced me to this DIY plaster art. Basically, you buy a canvas and put plaster on it that you can then shape and design in whatever sort of look you want to go for. It's really neutral and adds a lot of texture to a space, and I think I quite like it. This is, looks really easy. Maybe I could even do this one. I don't know. I mean, let's not get carried away. Alana Hurley took this IKEA stall shoe cabinet and applies this column cover that you can get for something like Home Depot. This is a very common shoe rack that Ikea makes. They are small and can fit anywhere, which I really like. And I think using the column cover is a really easy way to upgrade a basic Ikea item and give it a little bit more texture and a bit more style uh, rather than looking like kind of the plain old version we've seen a thousand times. Also, there's this Ikea Kallax hack. This comes from my good friend Viv from Posh Venny's over on YouTube. She took a Kallax unit and added burlap doors and then painted it. A very trendy upgrade to a really basic product from Ikea.